Hi there and welcome to number one Geeky Design Sads and we're back with some more Project Zomboid Snakes mod. Uh, we're also looking at the uh, uh, solar panel mod uh, at the moment and it looks like we've got 7 hours and 12 minutes. Uh, which really we kind of want 12 hours uh, discharge. If what I think is going to happen is going to happen. Uh, I don't know just yet. We're just waiting on it for the moment. I also want to put that table saw magazine back while I'm at it. So what I'm thinking is now, now I've turned it on, I'm wondering if once the sunshine comes along, it will uh, either slow down the, the rate of... of charge, or discharge, should I say, or pretty much keep it going in a rather nice sort of way. Right, I'm going to put the circular sword blade down here for the moment. As I have a lot of little bits and pieces that I'm going to need. Uh, including the small metal sheets there. Actually, how much was it for the table saw now? Extended building resources. Table saw. I needed... Four small metal sheets. So I've got exactly what I needed. Awesome. So I need to find five um, well, let's get the engine in as well kind of wondering if I need to start building myself like a like a work shed or something not sure because I mean I've got some more solar panels in the back of the van. And uh, I suppose I only need to power it up as and when I need it. So that could be a, a factor. So just switch it on and then use the item, switch it back off again and charge, so to speak. So there's an argument for that. <clears throat> I mean, the other option is, is I could connect some more panels here just to uh, just to give myself a faster recharge time. But it's actually just the batteries, I think, that's going to be the, the major issue. Did I actually put in those solar panels? Yes, I did. So I'm going to grab those. Also today, I'm going to start, I'm going to put these down here because that's traditionally where they were. I'm also going to grab the large uh, sheet metal. Do I have a mask? Yeah, I need my welder's mask somewhere. There's another bit of scrap metal there. We'll take that. I've lost my welder's mask, so I need to find that before it becomes a problem. Uh, did I pick up the solar panel? I did, didn't I? So that'll be... Did I pick up the solar panel? No, I picked up the scrap metal. That's why I went that way. Right. There's my welder's mask. Good stuff. Where's that large metal sheet that was on the floor? Okay, so what we're going to try to do is we're going to try to get our barricading done. Put a metal sheet over this this uh, Do it on the outside as well. Right, 
Just means that we're starting to get our metal working up. Now the other question is, do I have any more metals? Big metal sheets, of course. Nothing doing in there. Now there was a hell of a lot of um that's the two metal sheets there. Good, good, good. And a spare propane torch. Should probably end up becoming useful later on. Right, we don't. Oh, yeah. Let's uh, grab the tobacco, the watermelon, and the radish seeds. Uh, there's another inverter. Ah, yes, I wanted to have a look at that, didn't I? There's a certain solar panel bit. Uh, Makes solar fail safe. So, what's this? So, I need a V3 remote controller and a 50 amp hour car battery. Oh, that's a, that's the thing. Let's check. Let's see if uh, we're losing power now, or if it's charging, stroke, powering, sort of thing. Okay, so it is fully charged. So power-wise, in when it's during the day, we're doing all right. It's just. We need more batteries, I think, is the uh, truth. Try to get at least 12 hours uh, cover, maybe even 14 hours cover during the night, so to speak. Right, let's just uh, get these seeds out. I'm sorry, today, today's going to end up being a bit of a um, organisational day, I'm afraid. We're still trying to work out the battery bank, and I think we're getting there. I'm not too sure if it's all about. I'm wondering if that is if your um, generator stops, it'll kick in or turn on the... Bean seeds. Turn on the batteries. Actually, let's have a quick look at these guys. Still young potatoes. Okay. So, knowing what I know now... I think I am going to build myself a uh, workshop of sorts in here. So that's probably going to be a project for next week. What I will do, though, is I will start grabbing the wood for it, though. I suspect this axe is going to go. There. I ain't using my machete. In fact, the machete needs to go right back where...
Okay, well, let's kind of solve that problem. Doing a lump. I'm hearing banging. Which doesn't bode well. Because it's a player made resource. Zombies are going to go for it. Uh, do, 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 do. No, I'm just doing that, aren't I? Sawing logs. Like the wheels on the bus all day long. Okay, maybe I ought to do that off camera, to be honest, guys, because um, I am conscious this hasn't been a massively exciting episode, but if it's something about you trying to learn how to use the solar panel mod, uh, then uh, it's probably been a fairly good one for you. Uh, there's also a circular table, uh, which is something that we I'm quite excited about. Uh, what else have we got here? There's a solar panel. Let's, let's get that solar panel out of the way, shall we? And uh, also, I want to get the corn seeds, the carrot seeds. Any more seeds? No. Okay. Let's drop that down. So, yeah, I think I'm going to make myself a workshop. Because, obviously, with the extended building resources, you've got a fuel tank cheese table. Fur frame, dry cane support, and hunting target. Reloading table. So that's another item that we can... Uh... But I need the craft reloading table recipe. Okay. So what do I need there? Must be needed build fuel tank, or do you know the recipe? Okay. Cheese table. Fur frame. Okay. Dry cane support. Right. Got hunting trophies. Advanced, fr advanced wall frame. Okay. Cane walls, okay, so if you want to make a cane wall. Right. Don't know what Marco de Puerto de Troncas is. Door frame made of logs, okay. There you go. Log reinforcements. Okay. Okay, so uh, there's, there's a couple of extra bits and pieces in here that uh, obviously is needed. Um, obviously, this is the whole point of this game, is to uh, understand what we, what we might need to uh, create stuff. But I think the first thing I'm going to do uh, for next episode is to start looking at building a, um, a battlement across here so that I can see over the um the area so it's going to me mean making some steps so fun 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 in the sun 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 as they say and uh that's probably going to be it for me so please press that well boot that like button and uh if you can possibly uh, also press that subscribe button and if you super duper like what you see why not press that bell icon to get updated every time i upload new content to youtube so all that remains for me to say is thanks for watching, guys. I hope to see you next episode. And uh, it's a goodbye from me. So uh, take care, guys. See you later. Bye-bye.